Come on in. Hi. That's What's your. That? Hello. Come here. This is Who's your this? baby brother. Can't hold them. Come closer. Okay. Come okay. close. Come 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 Baby crew. Look at her feet. Whoa! <laughs> Don't poke. You gotta be really gentle give with him me. Give him a kiss? You wanna give him a kiss? Good oh. job. Oh. Oh. Did you do good? Okay. Yeah, it's crew. Can you say crew? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you can. Oh. Yeah. Can you you want to give crew a present? I... You got a present? Yeah. You need some water? What? Oh, you want keep a towel. You already saw this one? <laughs> what do you see? You know this one? Here, Cal, you want to give it to your brother? Can you give him a present? That's him, Chelsea. Thank you. Hey! Oh. <laughs> you want to help open it? Is <laughs> it pretty hard to open? A little, a little teether passy clip. That's so cute. Thankful for you. Happy birthday! <laughs> Thank you, Cal. Thank you. Crew has something for him. Oh, you got something for him? I think so. Yeah, right there. Yeah, Do you want to see what Crew got you? Crew got you a present. It's for you. <laughs> there you go. It's your present. You want your present later? Yeah. Let's give it a minute. Yeah. Okay, here, crew got this for you. Wow. What kind of stuff did he get you? Oh, paper. Whoa. Wow. Can you say thank you, crew? Yeah. <laughs> you want to open it? That's so nice. Did you say thank you, the crew? Oh, it's a little book to read. And it's for you, the itty bitty spider. <gasps> Look at this. <laughs> you can read it. Is that crew crying? It's okay. Yeah, it's okay. It's okay. Guy. <laughs> Poor Cal just left and he's definitely jealous. He didn't hardly want anything to do with me. He was screaming daddy as he was leaving. The whole way down the hallway. The whole way down the hallway. <laughs> So, I don't know. 
he'll get over it. He has to. But he was excited at first, like for the first few minutes, and then he was like, nope, not having it. But I'm just nursing. He's doing such a good job feeding right now. Just fed for like 19 minutes on one side, and now we're on the other side. I just am having such strong, uh, I guess, contractions when you are breastfeeding and you, your uterus starts yeah, no. contracting. So, I don't like it. It's really painful. I didn't have it that bad with Cal. I've heard they get worse with every uh, baby, so. But yeah, you're doing a good job. Yes, you are. I've got this set up. I'm kind of puffy. So, it's just me and David and crew now. We were just saying how, like, it's so easy this time. I don't know if Cal was just, like, a harder baby or I think it was just that we were new parents and like curves right behind me sleeping and like all he does is just sleep and then um, I pretty much undress him to feed him because that's the only way to wake him up so I wake him up and feed him and he sleeps and he's just so easy and I'm like newborns are easy I say this now we'll see what happens but I'm like Cal is way harder and I'm just eating my hospital dinner and then I think we're gonna have round two dinner later I am like ravenous today so hungry it's probably the hormones the breastfeeding my milk is not in yet but I am getting colostrum out so I'm just super hungry and it's only like it's not even six o'clock yet so I think he's gonna go out in a little bit and get us some dinner from somewhere and bring it into the hospital so that's what we're up to. I've just been Taco Bell. Taco Bell. <laughs> I've honestly just been relaxing. Like this has been kind of nice. Like with just snuggling with the baby, and I've been watching like YouTube and eating. <laughs> it's just been really good. I'm still pretty kind of puffy from all of the liquids, like the IVs that they put in you when you're in labor. So I think that's why I'm so puffy. But other than that, everything's pretty good. David's gonna go for a run. Where are you going? She's in my all-inclusive suite. Oh, yeah. Okay, we'll talk about dinner when you get back. Hey guys, so we are still at the hospital. It's the next day. Um, I wanted to do like a little clip of us coming home and being home with Cal and everything, but we're still here. Um, Sorry, I'm going to try to get through this quickly without getting emotional. It's just... Okay, I can talk now. Um, anyways, we are here our second night because I'm nursing him right now. Um, he threw up this morning um like green tinted clear and so I, I just assumed it was amniotic fluid um but luckily the nursing consultant had just walked in so I showed her and she said to check with the pediatrician and that it was like most likely like bile and so they had to run a bunch of tests and they just oh it escalated to a very emotional roller coaster of a day. Um, he had x rays, he had blood work, he had all kinds of things today, and I was just a mess. And it was just really hard. And you know, when you have a baby, you just you want everything to be perfect, obviously. And I know so many people go through things like this, and it's just it was very scary so we don't exactly know a full update yet but everything that they did today came back normal so that's really good and um, they want to keep him here another night just to make sure that he doesn't do it again and I think if he doesn't do it again we should be clear to go home tomorrow and everything's good it's just been crazy you know I just had a baby so my hormones are already crazy 
and then to go through everything we went through today was been insane but if it, if it were really bad he would be in the NICU right now and not here with me so basically I've been discharged he is staying as a patient so luckily they're super nice and letting us stay in the exact same room we've been in the past two nights so we're staying in the same room we just don't have like I don't have like my meals and my medicine delivered and stuff like that but I get to stay here and that's all that matters so um I'll do an update tomorrow and hopefully that will be the going home and all that excitement and fun like that but I just wanted to give a quick update without getting too emotional because it's been a hard day we get to go home today um he's been cleared and everything he didn't have any more of the bile so they don't really know why i think i think he was just really really um empty stomach and that's what happened and now that my milk's coming in he is eating just fine and i think everything's good so we got discharged and we get to take him home today um last night was really really hard though it was our first night that he didn't sleep and i remember like earlier like the first night I was like, oh, this is such a breeze. And then last night, literally like every, I would feed him, I'd lay him down and then he'd cry. Feed, lay him down, cry. It was just nonstop from like nine till probably five in the morning. I started crying. I was like, this is so hard. But I think he just needed so much food. I think he needed to get his body back on track. So hopefully now that he's back on track, he'll start to sleep for a little bit longer and yeah you guys want to see him what is that yeah better answer it it could be for well it is for us Ha <laughs> 
<laughs> What's that? What are you sleeping? Where did that come from? <laughs> he heard about the shows today. He looks like such a big boy now. Look how huge he is. Look at his feet. I told him he was big boy today. He is bored. Is it?